Oh no, wait, it was yesterday. So Diwali, I like. Diwali, I love. I like Diwali because there's a lot of illumination everywhere and Diwali is the reason why you see lights in the background. A lot of people um, wanted this makeup look. I did have this makeup look in the last video. So it's just essentially really deep red lips and just a lot of mascara on my eyelashes. The lipstick is by Ellie's Fuss. I would put the link down below. And the mascara is also by Ellie's Fuss. Both of them were sent to me for review purposes. And I really like them. But the funny thing is, I wanted this lip color. And I was like, I don't want to buy one. It's really pretty. It's a number um, L101. It comes in a really, really snazzy bullet packaging. The name is Blood Red and this is the color. All you have to do is you have to open it up. It has like this felt um, sort of cushioned thing on top. I've seen that in Lakme Lac um, lipsticks as well. And you just click it from the bottom like you go like that. And you have to like initially if the first time you've bought it, first time you have to click it quite a lot for the product to dispense. But right now I just do three clicks and the product is there and you just like tap it on. And you know the good thing about this is um, you, if you have a little bit of product left on top of it, you can just put it on your cheeks and blend it out and it will act like a natural blush. Because this is actual deep blood red and I love it. Um, this is Ellis fast cosmetics brochure and i think i have this red it's like a blood red yeah. it says the classic red lip is surprisingly hard to come by since most red lipsticks are either too blue or too orange for many complexions ellis red is a universal versatile red that is flattering on all women a new classic from ellis fast human colors 
Alice Red is sure to suit any complexion. Yeah, and it's available in three um, textures. There's a creamy one, there's a milky one, and a glazed one. I have, I think this is creamy. Hmm, that is creamy. And I have, I have two more products from LA Spas that I would want to review. One of them is a eyeshadow, a liquid eyeshadow, and then the other one is um, it's milky lips. So I think I think I will be reviewing that. And also LA Spas Cosmetics, they have these really cool um, holders. Look, it's literally like gun casing. Like you put the bullets in right around here. It reminds me of the Terminator movies, I don't ask me why. Um, and what else? I really wanted to try the Ellie Spas foundation. And these are the creamy eye eyes. And I've already um, tried, I think I have this one. 101? Yeah, I have this one, the 103. I'll be reviewing that. It's super easy to apply. I suck at eye makeup, but. That is so easy to use, like I was like, what? No. And then there are, oh yeah, there we go. Creamy lips, milky lips, glazed lips. I know that sounds like candy to me, but... Whoa, can you see it? Can you see it? Can you see it? I really should not have that much of fruity. I hope you like this video and if you did then subscribe, you could follow me on Facebook, you could follow me on Twitter, you could also follow me on my blog, I would put the links down below. Um, do leave a comment, I always read your comments, okay? I thought I should do a random part in the video. I thought I should talk about crap. This usual crazy crap that I want to talk about. What the hell? my foundation and I haven't been able to finish it and it expires next year. And there's so much of crap in it. It's like more than half left. What the hell am I gonna do? And expires in 2013. <laughs> Shit, this expires in February 2013. Crap. You know what I did to my brush? Look. I sort of broke my brush. Br I broke my blushes. The packaging. So I sort of took this old color bar uh, eyeshadow pack that I had. And I, you know, I scraped off the blush, which is, like, it was completely intact, okay? It was, the amount that I bought was there, like, prevalent in that blush thing. And so I just, ugh, I just, uh, <laughs> I just took that blush and I put it inside and I took some um, rubbing alcohol and I put it inside and I put the rubbing alcohol and it did set. And then this morning, when I was taking out makeup, this fell off from my almira and yeah, this is how dead it is, look. Ugh, so, yeah, I'm assuming I need a new blush, so. Tell me which blushes I can buy because, you know, because this is definitely not happening. I love this lipstick. I think this lipstick is pretty much the bomb right now. So this brush, is pretty ridiculous, cuteless, <laughs> and I really like it. Bouncy.